I think we might want that. That's a perfect fit for the Camry, I think. Holy cow. What the hell kind of car does this tire go on? I don't know. Ooh, look at these nice candles. Bayberry, my favorite. Light bulbs. Ooh, look. I took another one of these the other day. So I guess now we have a matching pair. I don't know what they are though. And you know what? I think I'm gonna come back for it later. I don't wanna drive around with that in the car all day. That's our first pile. Welcome to trash picking in a lovely suburb. There's the magnet. In this neighborhood, we really don't need the magnet. But, uh, It's a nice little formality. But we knew it was copper before we got out of the car. Have you ever seen one of these before? Wow, that's really gross. I never wondered how they made rice cakes. What do you think? Do we need any of this stuff? No. But that thing is cool. See something new every day. Actually, you don't.
kind of rare to see something new, but we saw something new today. Want to go look at some art? What do you think? Looks old. Who's ELH? Eh. I think we can live without it. And if that's a $10,000 watercolor that I should have taken, leave your opinion in the comments, which I always read. My heart is pounding, because I haven't found one of these in a long time. Ah, uh, it's so pretty. Let's see, it's a Dino VFR with Tioga cranks, Victor pedals, pork chop sprocket. Cheap wheels, Sugino stem. Amy tries knockoff brakes. You know what this is? This is like some kid who wanted to go race BMX. And his parents had enough common sense not to go spend 500 bucks on a bike. So they put together this nice little zippy ride for him. Lightweight seat. Maybe he raced it, maybe he didn't. Not really a valuable bike, but definitely Definitely something really cool to find. Look at that. Bear trap headset. Even got the pad set so you don't jar your narbles on the top tube. That is so excellent. And it's like the second thing we've found all day and we've been here for four hours, so. No wait, two hours. And I found a lamp. And a pair of rubber boots. So we're doing okay. That is a heavy pump. I don't want all that plastic. I'll take that off, off camera. There we're finished, courtesy of my 14 millimeter gear wrench. Over the years, I've learned to carry the 13 and the 14. The rest of them I really don't need very often. But those are really brilliant tools. And we got some great pumps.
We're not exactly stacking clips today. But here's the cool thing. Oh. I really hate it when they're filled with beer though. a lot of weight but it's also like a $50 bill So that's a good thing. What else we got? A whole lot of nothing. Pretty much. And that looks like a really fancy keg too. That's not like a... Uh like a bud keg or a Coors keg. That's like a like a real pro level keg. Not bad. All right, my video is getting too long lately, so we'll do a couple more clips, wrap this one up. We're going out again tomorrow, and the next day, and the next day, and every day. We never stop. Did I forget? No, I remembered. All right. Not bad. Look at the pride they had in their product. Stamping it Delta. Look at the new one they got. Anything in here? No. This is my idea of a perfect load. Not too much in the trunk. A cool bike. The back seat isn't overloaded. It's mellow, but we haven't actually made any money today, so. Hopefully we'll find some more stuff before the end. You know, I wasn't going to record at this pile. It's kind of a cool table over there. Yada, yada, yada. But I did find this great bucket. First of all, it's the railroad track. I find these once in a while. Roar! Thing weighs a ton. We got these little casters, which are cool. But I really wanted to show you guys these. Look at those crazy gears. What do you think those are from? I don't know, but I think probably from some kind of 
piece of machinery. I think my friend's gonna turn them into a lamp. So keep your eyes open for that. Anyway, I think we are going to end the video here. Because that was a cool score. I've got hours left to go. Got to fill this back seat up, but you guys got a taste. So, oh, forgot to put that in there. I'll put that in there later when I put my gloves back on, but till next time, thanks for keeping me company. And I will see you when I see you.